Hi crypto fans, welcome to CCS Cryptocurrency State. My name is Santiago, I'm a web developer and investor. And in today's video, we are going to cover Gamma Swap. This is a free airdrop because it's in testnet stage. We are going to cover, like always, a little bit about the project. And this Swap DX project has some technical aspects different that make it really, really cool. And like always, we are going to do the step by step on how to participate on this testnet with the possibility to an airdrop in the future. And like you know guys, I have been launching my subscriptions for the Discord and also the subscription for my application plus the Discord channel. My application will help you to organize your airdrops and register all the airdrops that I put in the channel and you will be able to create your custom airdrops there too. So you can go to this link cryptocurrency.net slash subscriptions and you will be able to see this video where I explain and actually I show you the application. In case you are interested to get really, really serious, you need to go to the Discord channel where we are already sharing a lot of things there. And with my application, you are going to move into the next levels in airdrops. Before we begin, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, click the bell to get the notifications. And without anything else, let's get into it. Hey guys, well like always, remember that in the description is the link for the airdrop organizer where you have all the airdrops video that I have been covering with all the information that you need and with my videos and my step by step. So you can go there and check all the airdrops that you are missing. And if you use my application, all those airdrops are already loaded in my application. So it's really, really easy to do all these airdrops using my app. So if you already are in one of my subscriptions for the app, I recommend you to really do all of them. And if you have airdrops that are not in my list that I didn't cover, you can create your own airdrops there to manage everything in my app. So in today's video, we are going to cover Gamma Swap. This is the first Oracle Free Volatility DX. And it's not like any other swap. They have been actually really working on the technical aspects and how to provide better liquidity, less fees on the transactions and many other things. So I will put a couple of links also in the description for the technical aspect. If you want to understand more about that, I have these two links. One is a tweet where it explains a little more about this model of the AMM and liquidity pools, how they plan to manage all that. And also from Tinder, shout out to Tinder, uh, here is also some explanation on how the project works in a technical aspect. This is a more easy approach if you are not so familiar with the technical aspect of how a DX works. But for a question of time, we are not going to cover the technical aspect. We are going to go to the step by step. This is the first Oracle Free Volatility DX and Gamma Swap is launching on Arbitrum and will lead DX narrative to the next level. They are innovating in permanent gains instead of impermanent loses, enabling users to trade on volatility. So the first thing and the second thing guys here, like always, is follow them on Twitter, follow them on Discord. This time you really need to follow them on Discord because you are going to need some free tokens from this network and you are going to get them from the Discord. So you really need to follow the Discord to do this airdrop. Then one thing that I saw is that if you go to the homepage, the step three is go to the homepage. And if you click on get notified at lunch, you are going to be sent to this page. And here you can put an email and you probably you are going to be notified on lunch. I don't know if this is important or not for the airdrop, but I will do it if I was you. So that will be the step three. Put your email there just to be notified on the lunch. Now the step four is we need to add Gamma Network on Metamask. Here is the link for the Discord channel where that information was explained. But basically they have their own Gamma Swap testnet. So if you are in Metamask and you never added the network manually, then you can go here, go in the networks and click here on add network. This is going to pop up a window for you. Click on add a network manually. And here you need to put the network name, the RPC URL, chain ID and cur currency symbol. And the block explorer URL is optional. So let's put that information from the step here for. Once you put this information, you need to click on save. 
and you are going to be connected right now here to gamma swap testnet you have zero ethereum here and now we go to the next step this is step five on the discord channel we need to go to the channel called test tours and put your wallet to receive thousand tokens and a bot is going to swipe the addresses posted there each 60 minutes and send you some material. I already did this, sounds a little weird, but actually it happened. Around after 30 minutes I received the tokens, I don't know exactly when they start to count the 60 minutes, but at least you need to wait maybe one hour in order to receive your tokens. So go to this link that it will send you directly to that part on the Discord channel. And here you can see everyone is putting the address. It's not something that I made up. So here you need to post your address and wait that time until you get some tokens on your Ethereum. So it's going to be easy to know because you are going to be here on Gamma Swap Testnet and you are going to have some Ethereum. Uh, I don't remember exactly how much it was. I think it was 0 0.25. We are going to check now that. Like you can see I am in Gamma Swap testnet, I have 0 0.1 Ethereum, but actually they send you, like I said before, 0 0.25, so you are going to have a quarter of Ethereum here, remember this is faucet, so there's no value on that. And now we are going to go to step 6, this is once you get your Ethereum, then you will get access to other tokens like UNI, BIT, USDC, and other tokens that you will need to the liquidity pool and open long gamma positions. So now we need to go and connect the wallet to the application and click on the wallet button. You will see a button to request from the faucet pop-up underneath. Click it, there will be a list of other test tokens. You simply request the tokens and it's going to be a delay from each token. But basically I have the URL directly there. So you can go to that URL. Of course, first you need to connect the wallet. Now, once you are connected, you can see down here that say faucet and click on request. And you are going to see all this list of tokens. You can start to request them. It's very quick and don't take too much time. But the reason why you need the Ethereum previously is because you need to pay these gas fees. So if you don't have the Ethereum first, you are not going to be able to get these test tokens. So you can see it's waiting for the thousand tokens. In the meantime, I'm still going to do another request for other tokens for the USDC, for the USDT. It doesn't matter that you have pending transactions, it's going to be resolved over time. Probably I'm going to ask all the to request tokens just in case. And here you can see that you have been requesting the assets correctly and everything was confirmed. So you should be having your tokens now. So we are going to move to the next step. And that is the step seven. Now you should be ready to test out the gamma strategies. Play around and click the different tabs. Practice helping, shorting the liquidity and changing the collateral ratio. You can see more information about that in the documentation on how to do all that. i just going to create a liquidity pool right now, just for you to see. But for more detailed information on how to use everything, you can just go to the official documentation. So let's say USDT with Rapid Ethereum. I'm going to click on Provide Liquidity. And I have 10 USDT and 10 Rapid Ethereum. I will put one there. Click on Approve. Confirm. The confirmation could take some minutes even, so one or two minutes, so be patient, just don't click anything. Confirm again. You need to give permission for both tokens. Now you can click on the button confirm here. Confirm the transaction to add into the liquidity pool there. And this has been done successfully. Now we can go to balances and you can see that we have been entered here on this liquidity pool. You can withdraw some part, deposit more. Now I will click here on borrow APY, click on borrow liquidity. And here you can play a little bit about the projected strike price. You can put some expected collateral for link, rapid Ethereum and how much you are going to borrow here. So you can try it a little bit, click on approve, give permission to access to your link tokens. Now that was successfully approved, click on confirm down here. 
and I successfully borrow liquidity here. Now I am redirected to the portfolio part where I can borrow more, I can rebalance or repay. Again, you can go and read the documentation if you want to do more stuff for the airdrop, but with that I am already done. So now the last step is give the feedback and to do that you can see here on the right side of the application that you can click there and give a feedback how was your experience here i will put that i like it and you can put a comment here if you want to now you can click on send your feedback and you can put your email here again you can use the same email that you used before for the home page so put your email and click send. And the other way to give a feedback is in the Discord channel. You have a channel called Product Feedback. So here everyone is putting uh, comments and screenshots and they are putting their address too. So maybe that, has, that is also a good idea to do. I am not sure because in the official documentation they don't say about putting the, the address here, but you can do it if you want to. I think it's not a bad idea neither. So with those two, two things, you are giving your feedback and probably that is going to serve you and be considered for a possible airdrop. I think this kind of project is going to have eventually an airdrop. Um, swap DXs usually make some kind of airdrops. So guys, that is all for Gamma Swap. I think it's worth it to try it. It's not so difficult to apply it. You just need to wait a little bit to get your Ethereum, but besides that, it's really easy and to the point. You should do this in 15 minutes after you get your Ethereum. <clears throat> and remember guys, check my subscription here on my website. The links are going to be in the post, of course, and check how my application works. Even if you don't want to sign up right now, just check it because it's good that this is an application that works for you and you are interested just to know that exists. I am happy if you know that my application exists, even if you don't subscribe right now. So give it a try. Check this video. It's in my YouTube page also. And maybe in a couple of months you want to join us, but it's okay if you at least know that this application exists. I created it because actually I couldn't find anything like this to help me to manage my airdrops. That is why as a developer I started to do my own application and now I am sharing you with you with a very considerable cheap price from my perspective. I spent thousands of dollars with all these guys. So yeah, I am in red like a big time. So all the subscriptions that I earn. It's only to pay part of what I have been spending here on this YouTube channel, with my webpage, with the application, with many things that help you to get my airdrops videos. So don't think that I am doing millions with these guys. It's not the case for me. I am a, a new YouTuber here, just trying to help you. And of course, I cannot continue spending all my money on the YouTube channel. So part of this subscription is to help me to recover from that. That is all guys, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, click the bell to get the notifications and I will see you in the next video. Bye.